How are you? Okay. You know, the day before yesterday, I made an announcement that uh, in our school, in this international school, it is not allowed that you speak Hindi. Is that clear? Yes. The day before yesterday, on Monday, I announced that if you speak Hindi, and if I heard, and if Arnold Sir, if any management caught you in speaking Hindi language, the mother language, then you will find 10 rupees as penalty charge. And many of the students who spoke Hindi on Monday, I heard and I caught you. On Monday, when I caught you in speaking Hindi language, and then I charged 10 rupees as a fine, and yesterday I got that money from the student. And that money you know, would be collected by me, and that money will go to the school fund, and that will help to uh, you know, organize any kind of programs in future. So today, this today onwards, you know, I am very strict about this rule. You don't take it so lightly. If I found, if I hear, if I listen in your class, in gallery, among your friend circle, with any teacher, in Hindi language speaking, then you will not be left. <laughs> It's very, very strict atmosphere that if we allow you to speak Hindi, so one day you will also speak Bhojpuri in our school. So, I don't want this atmosphere in this international school. I want all of you to meet, just like Englishmen. I want you to speak UK and US accent. I want you to speak the English language properly in my school premises. I know that, you know, for 16 hours, for 16 hours you spend your time with your family members. Is that right? Yes, sir. For 16 hours you spend your precious time with your guardians, with your family, with your parents. Only for 8 hours, more than 8 and, eight and a half hours, you spend your time to your school. Okay. For 8 and a half hours you spend time in our school. So if we make you, just like the listener of English language, if you make you to listen to English language, for continue eight hours, I hope that one day you will be a very, very good speaker. But that is not happening. Many students are taking this thing as, you know, joking, mocking, like, like Manishwar has told, he will forget. Manishwar has told this rule and he will forget. No, I never forget anything in my life. The things from my childhood to my, you know, this age, I remember and I learn all of the incidents, what happened with me. I cannot forget anything. Since today onwards, I am very strict. If I or any of the person or managing team, if they found you speaking Hindi language, the Hindi bhasha, so you will be charged 10 rupees as a fine. It's not a game. You just take it seriously. You don't drop that, okay, I have to pay 10 rupees to Manish sir, okay, Manish sir will announce my name. No. I will not announce your name. It would be like a punishment for you. It would be a very shameful moment for you that you are paying 10 rupees to speak in Hindi. Since today, we are also going to have English spoken classes. Since today, we are going to have and start spoken classes in our school. From class 5 to 9, I will take the classes of all the students from class 5 to 9 and the students from class 1 to 4 will be taken by Sunita Ma'am. So, you get ready for uh, learning the British language. You get ready to speak the international language in this international school. We are trying to make you like the British, but you are not trying to be like that. In spite of making all those rules, Many of just speak Hindi when I went out of their class. They, they think that Manishwar has gone, now I speak Hindi. They think that there is no Manishwar, there is no Arnav sir. Okay, now I speak Hindi. If you are coming to our school, to a CBC Buddhist school, so I will not cheat you. I will not make your parents cheated by us because they are paying very, very high fee, very high amount for your learning, for your education. And one thing I noticed that, you know, how lazy some of students have been. They are very, very lazy. When they give you some homework, like make a project work, decorate your face, uh, you know, uh, fair copy, make it decorated. Many of you say, 
No, sir, I can't. I don't have time, sir. Sir, how it is possible, sir? Sir, in a single day it is not possible, sir. How lazy you are. Not lazy. How you can say how miser you are. How you can say, you know, you are very, very cunning student now. If you study in the higher school in Patna, in Mumbai, in Delhi, you must complete the homework. But if you study in our school, look at it, you know, that is in our local region, in our locality. You think that it's a local school? No. It is Peace International School, which is better than any other CSC board school. Because we have teachers from outsiders. No other school have teachers from outsiders. You can see all the Indians here, from West Bengal, from Odisha, from Darjeeling, from Uttar Pradesh, from Bihar. You can see that all the Indians are here. So come on, if you have a good teachers from all over the India, why don't you learn from them? Why don't you learn their languages, their traditions, their customs, their festivals, rituals and all the talent which those teachers have? Simply passing your time in the class, simply learning syllabus, simply learning the course will not make you genius. If you want to be genius, you have to study more in spite of them. You have to understand every chemical equation in chemistry. You have to understand IUPAC name in chemistry. You have to understand every numerical in physics. You have to understand each and every mathematical formulas, derivations in math subjects. You have to understand each and every word meanings, the proverbs, idioms, synonyms, antonyms and all explanation, poetry, words name in our English language. If you do so, then you become a genius. Yesterday, you know, I saw a video on YouTube. There is a boy of, you know, 11 years old, 10 years old, you know, from Bihar. His name was Sunu. He talked to the chief minister of Bihar. Come on, very confidently he went to the uh, place and he talked with them. With the confidence he had, what a self-belief, you know, he had. If I call you here on the stage, many of you get nervous. Many of you are getting you know, you know, scared, your hands are trembling, shocking, there's some electric current in your hand. I always tell you that uh, don't be scared of the people standing in front of you. Don't think that they are knowing better than you. Your confidence, come on, grow your confidence. Grow your self-belief. Perform, practice in your home. Stand in front of the mirror, talk to your own reflection, and that practice will make you a very good talker and speaker. We all trying, we all trying to make this international school and the students super, superior, and excellent, but you are not ready to get our thing. So, so I am very strict. If I found anybody speaking Hindi language, I will be charged as well as I will punish them. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Have a great day.